Hey guys, welcome to All True Comics All Topic. We're your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. Also known as David Clark. And Walter Ryan. And today we're talking about Naruto chapter 670. Uh yeah, it's been a while since we've talked about him, but uh Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Before uh, we get into it, let's talk about why we haven't talked about Naruto. It sucks. Yeah, it hasn't been the best. And it, it, it's not the best this week either. But well, first let's talk about all the things we hate about Naruto since like we stopped reviewing it. Uh, let's see what's happened. Uh, Madara, for some reason... Well, one, I hate his arrogance. He's like, I'm, I'm so much better than all you guys. Well, dude, you're an immortal zombie with infinite chakra. Like, no, no, he was. He was. And, and at the point in time when he was an immortal zombie with infinite chakra, that made sense. Right. But now he's alive because he wanted to be a jinjuriki, which is stupid because you already had infinite energy. <laughs> oh, yeah. and then... Like I hate how he's like he keeps talking down talking down to the first Okage. And it's like, do you understand that for you to beat this man, you had to come back from the dead with eyes you didn't have, and then have that man's DNA face sewn into your body, and then you had to steal his sage chakra just to learn how to do it. So you are you are like you and him plus like five other things just to be on his level. Yeah. Okay, now let's put this into perspective. Um, okay, Madara supposedly now is, is the equal of the Sage of the Six Paths, like right, right now, right? Or so, or okay. half of it, or something. something yeah, stupid. yeah, something. Okay, and last episode, last issue, he was getting the crap kicked out of him by Mike Guy. This is the coolest <laughs> thing I've seen them all get in a long time. He's like, you know what, Eight Gates. They just punch you in the face a lot. <laughs> I, I I did enjoy that because like I, I think like my like, like guy and and Rock Lee especially have been given like like a raw deal because like think about it during the pain invasion they were they were the only team not there you know why because if they were there They'd the fight been. wouldn't have made sense because guy would have been like seven gates great pain <laughs> and and now I'd be like but. I'm the hero. He's like, nah, I got guys are hero. He just saved the village. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, but then again, you know, pain with the uh, the ability to be, I don't know, six, seven, twelve people. Doesn't matter. He's my, he's my guy. Nah. Morning peacock, afternoon tiger, midnight elephant. That's cool against one person. Nah, he's fast enough to go get everybody. I'm sure he is, but I'm just saying, remember, you know, remember, like remember, but Madara, I think like Madara is way faster than 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 Pain is. And I believe Madara is also it, it seems right now that he seems to be faster than than Naruto was. Naruto was faster than Pain. Yeah. And if and guy if is my, if my guy is baby shaking this guy all over the field right now, that means he could probably take Pain no problem. He probably walk up, snap the neck and walk to the next one and do the same thing over and over again. Yeah, it is funny though. The Madara keeps going. Wow, if he hits me one more time, this is I'm over. Dead. Yeah, it's like, hey, do you know what would have prevented that? Um, being an undead zombie. <laughs> that probably, no matter how much he hits you in the face, you probably would be okay. Sidebar: I am going to make this about Superman, by the way. Okay, if and I did say if your choices are go to a planet mm -hmm. that makes you a god, right? Or turn it into a place where you are normal. Right. Why would you turn it into a place that makes you normal? Because you're homesick. That is dumb. That is the dumbest thing. Okay, whoever wrote that part of the of this script, that was stupid. Okay, there's no way General we, Zod... We, 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 we know the guy who storyboarded it. We probably shouldn't. Oh, yeah, huh? I, we are friends with him on Facebook. He will see this video. <laughs> I don't care. You know what? That was dumb. <laughs> that was dumb. There's no way General Zod gives up the powers of Superman to become a normal person. That just doesn't make any sense. Okay, now back to back to Naruto. Okay. Uh, um, yeah. So that happened. Guy is do, doing great. Um, like ne Neji died, and it was stupid. Like he like put his back out to protect Naruto or protect Hinata, who's protecting, protecting Naruto. From that little tendril thing, but it's like, hey, did, did you Hugo's forget you have this awesome move called Kai Ten where you can spin really fast and nothing can hurt you? No, the, they've got the little blind spot. Maybe he didn't see it coming. Oh, so he just jumped in the middle for no reason. He's like, hey, let me just, <laughs> hey guys, how's it going? And I'm like, what? First of all, and, and, and like, and they couldn't heal him right then with like ninja magic. Naruto has had holes punched in his chest all the time. Everybody's chakra's gone. They're all no. using Naruto's chakra. No. 
They were like, no. First of all, what happened to soldier pills? Remember those from way back in the day? Yeah. Where you like you get a, like, why is not everybody using them? Because they they all they, that's like part of their standard equipment. Like you you you're just going let your best Hugo die in the middle of a war. Why are all the medical ninjas all huddled up together in one spot? Because they're have weak. We, have you noticed that? They're weak. They're, they're all like Sonata and Sakura. Yeah, that, but they're all like sitting in one spot saying, oh my god, we have to go help people. But, we're not, but, but we're not though because there's a war right there. <laughs> and I am not going over there. But I mean, it just, it was, uh, and then and then he's like, you call me a genius. It's like, you know what a genius would have done? They would have kite ten the crap out of that. Or instead of taking that hit, like, wait for it to get a little closer and attack from the side. Don't get in front of it. Try and destroy it. Spider-Man died the same way. That's not saying much. They're both stupid. Spider-Man's supposedly the best superhero in Marvel. No, he's not. It's a lie. <laughs> That's a lie. Uh, anyway. I'm just saying, look, Ultimate Spider-Man jumped in front of a bullet for Captain America. That's nice. Real Spider-Man would have saved Captain America... And wouldn't have been Couldn't shot. Couldn't you like pull Cap out of the way, or if you were to block it, I don't know, block it with like your leg or your arm or something? Because aren't his bones like a little stronger than everybody else's? Well, you would think that they have some kind of human version of chitin. So, so. could you just be be like, it's like you know, like block it like that? So yeah, it hurts, but you'll be good like in a day. No, let me use my heart to block it, because that won't kill me immediately. Anyways, or it will. Okay, okay. Or it will. so, um, but yeah, um, uh, let's see what else hap- has happened since then. Oh, uh, okay, this one, <sighs> Kamado's back, which, I mean, people predicted what would happen, because he was in that infinite loop until he learned to be a better person, which I'm, I'm assuming for him it felt like a thousand years, probably. Yeah, so that kind of makes sense for, like, for him and his brain. Um, but now he's trying to help Sasuke... By feeding him a snake out of his stomach into Sasuke's stomach, and it looks incredibly gay. <laughs> like, so gay. I was gonna say gross, but okay. No, 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 uh, no. This, yeah. is, this is like, um, yeah. Most, most of Leonardo are homosexual. Like, not, not, not insulting. Actually homosexual. <laughs> <laughs> like, this is, this is a, this is episode of Transformers. Yes, I know I go off on tangents. It's okay, this is off topic. There's this episode of Transformers where, like, Optimus Prime finds out that he and Alita One, his girlfriend, um, the leader of the female Autobots, um, also share the same type of life force. And so he's told that if you pull this hose out right here and mm-hmm. hook it into this little hole right here, you can pump your life force into her and save her life. Mm hmm. Yeah, okay, it's like that, except for it's not a male and a female. Right, and with robots, it makes sense because they're freaking robots. You are a human being, Kabuto. Well, you were, now you're a dragon. Well, it's kind of a dragon snake yeah, thing. Yeah, but it's gross, though. He's other like, people's chakra. Just like, I, I don't know, pumping life force or something into him. So that, oh, by the way, you, you know that because Kabuto has a, I think he has Senju cells, you know, like from the first Okage. Mm-hmm. So that's going to end up having both and end up having, like, the Ren Gun or some stupid little crap. Yeah, which then will make him the Hokage. But then Naro have the Ren and Gun too, and they'll both be the same six paths. They'll be they'll be each a half of it. Okay, which which brings me to uh, brings me to the thing that we were talking about before we mm. started this video about the fact that uh you know spoiler alert, um, Naruto has actually just met the real Sage of Six Paths. Yeah. And the Sage of Six Passes just told him that he is the reincarnation uh, of the younger, his, son. Uh, the younger son, the one who had to work for everything he ever achieved. Right. But, my, but mind you, he worked for everything he had to achieve, but he actually surpassed the guy who was the genius. Yeah, because then he they eventually got the same power as him, but that also had friends. <laughs> so, like, he's like, yeah, like, okay, I'm going to take a break from fighting you. My army's going to fight you real quick. I'm going to go bang these hot, hot chicks over here because I'm, <laughs> cause the Senju seem to have a lot better children. Yeah. Because, I mean, yeah. like, one of their kids raped in the entire Uchiha clan. Just one. Yeah. The other one, his little brother, learned to raise the dead. <laughs> yeah, that's a... Uh, um, they call it a zombie apocalypse. Okay, probably, anyway, probably. so... But they're so much better. Think yeah, about they it. Are. They like, really Madara's are. like, okay, I can do fire moves and earth moves and summon Susanoo, which is really impressive. Unless you're fighting people who can teleport, raise the dead, make life, have sage mode. I mean, it's just, you're not that impressive. I'm sorry. You're just like, and that's just two guys. We, we didn't even hear about the rest of the clan. Like, what, what could they do? <laughs> well, okay. That having, that having been said, okay, mm-hmm. now, now. 
the, the Sage of Six Paths had two sons. Right. Okay. So we know that Naruto is the reincarnation of the younger son. Right. Now, if the reincarnation of the older son is Madara, which it, because like, because like, the reason why we say this is because we were talking earlier. Madara technically was still alive when Obito went to the village to go screw crap up. I mean, unless Obito killed him as per their plan right before he left. Um, Sasuke was already born at that moment. So until they tell us exactly the moment where Madara died in between meeting Obito but, and the Nine-Tailed Fox thing, oh, Madara actually, was still alive. So he's probably the reincarnation. Actually, no, Madara would still have to be alive because Madara was the one who set the Nine-Tailed Fox on the, on, on the village, right? No, no, that was uh, oh, that, 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 that was uh, Okay. Wait, Wait a minute. Are we, no, no, it's, it's Madara. No, 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 no. The, when, when the guy who went to the ni- to, to the village and pulled the nine tails out of Kushina, that was Obito. Okay. Yeah. That's why I like, when I was like, oh my God, how did I not notice? I'm so sad. I hate myself. <laughs> By the way, that's another thing I'm, I'm so mad at is they have been taking a crap on the character of the fourth Hokage this entire thing. Like, they, they for, everyone thought the flying thunder god was him. Oh no, it ends up it was actually the second Hokage. He's just better at it than him. No. No. He's not doing anything. He lost both his arms. He's just like being pathetic and not doing much of anything. He's supposed to be the best Hokage and ninja ever produced ever. Okay. This is Darth Vader all over again. Okay. Episodes 4, 5, and 6. Darth Vader is awesome. literally the most awesome bad guy you have ever seen. And then 1, the, 2, the, and 3 happen. <sighs> And, and you suddenly realize that all he is is a whiny little boy with breathing problems. Kind of the same. Th- well, for, the horse is not whining. Well, no, he does whine. He does whine. He does whine. He's he does basically th- he's basically older Nardo who apparently isn't quite as skilled. But he, he but, is, but, though. He's just but, being just downplayed for no reason. I mean, but, I mean, to be fair, though, like, the, the last chapter... With no arms, he was able to teleport in front of a guy who was going super fast, which is probably impressive just in and of itself. Um, and then, oh, I think, I think, I think Akashi threw the, the kunai. He teleported there, mm. like absorbed Radar's attack, and you know, shielded guy. And I, I don't know where he took it, but that was impressive because that was with no arms. I'd be like, no, I'm gonna sit over here, dude. I got no arms right now. <laughs> but yeah, I, I, I totally get the feeling that like uh, as this thing is whole is winding down, that. They basically just don't want us to want Naruto to keep going. I, 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 I mean, I mean, it's not unheard of. Uh, Bandai did that for for Gundam with G Gundam. They they tried to make something so terrible, people would stop liking it. Why you want to kill off him that that makes money for you? I don't know. Well, I mean, if you're tired of doing it, and again, we we said this before, like about two years ago, when we started noticing that the quality was getting really bad. Mm. If you don't, if you're tired of doing it. Don't destroy what I love. Just just stop doing it. Just, you know, finish this arc awesomely and then go, hey, it's not coming back. But, like, I'm cool with you, that. You could tell he's just frustrated with it. Like, it's just coming out in his writing. He's all oh, his lack of writing. Um, it's just... It's sad. <laughs> it's sad. <laughs> it's like, and, and now they're beginning to do all these little weird leaps. We're like, okay, Naruto has been... Naruto's been getting a heart massage for, like, the past six issues. No, yeah, dude. She's just standing there right now. He's just dead. <laughs> oh, also, Kyren, Ky- Kyren, who's also an Uzumaki, I guess, um, has Kushina's chain power all of a sudden. Like, you remember? When, yeah, yeah. yeah, she's had the chain power. And it's like, okay, there are two things wrong with this. One, how about all the times where Kyren almost died? Chains probably would have come in handy. Just saying. And two, why does Naruto have that? Maybe he does. No, I no. Think they're gonna wreck Kyren. His mom, he'll, he'll, his mom would be like, "Hey, son, real quick, you have chains, use them." They're gonna, wreck, they're gonna wreck Kyren. He'll, he'll have them. Like, as, and when he wakes up this time, he's going to be, he's gonna have all his powers fully realized. You know, kind of like when he came off what the powers, island. What powers? No, he doesn't have the, the, any of the demons anymore. I mean, like, well, all his powers will be re- fully realized. Like, like when he, <laughs> he'll just get a bag with no inflation whatsoever. Like, no, hell, when he came off the island, he, he just was awesome. He got on. He went on the island. Like he met B, then he disappeared. Well, to be fair though, that was him having control of the QB. That because that, 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 that was him using the QB chakra. Yeah, he, he, and he's very good using chakra. So that that was you know 
and he okay. had an infinite source. So that, that that makes sense. That wasn't really much of anything else. But he, he could still grab Sage Mode. I mean, he doesn't need the QB for that. What do you mean? He doh oh, 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 right now, like, oh, when he wakes up? Yeah. Yeah, but he'd have to, like, gather it for a while. And I'm pretty sure Madara is not going to let that happen. Well, actually, no, but see, Madara, might, might, Madara doesn't know how he gathers it. I think he does, because right now he's a sage right now. Like, he'd be able to see it happen. No, no, no. no. Well, no, that's not what I'm saying, though. Yeah. What I'm saying is that, remember how Naruto did it the first did it the first time, like, the, when he's fighting the, the pains the with the clones sitting way back in Yeah, the... but he'd be able to see the sage chakra. Okay. So he'd be like, hmm, what's going on over there? Now I'd be like, don't worry about it. It's cool. <laughs> it's Just fight me right here. You sure? Because that looks really important. Over there, so, those three clones yeah, way a mile away. That looks important. Yeah, you put it like a thousand clones. Oh, well, he probably only has energy for a hundred clones now. Well, technically, I think he's supposed to still have the Kiwi's chakra. Because when, when he when he took it out of the Kiwi in that, that fight, mm -hmm. that's supposed to be his forever. That's why, that's why Gara can still fight on that level. Because that chakra uh -huh. stays with you forever. Just not, it's the, just no, not, not the, the beast itself. Not the beast. Which, I don't really know what benefit that gives you other than having a supersized phone, uh, friend, but... Uh, well, I mean, the sage named them so you could work with them as equal. First of all, yeah, that teamwork crap is bull crap. Because you don't need teamwork when you're super strong. Like, Superman doesn't need Justice League. That's just a fact. That is a, that's a cold hard fact. Yeah, it's really Maybe true. Maybe Batman for some things. That's about it. The Hulk doesn't need the Avengers. And he's proven that by leaving and coming back as he wills. <laughs> Teamwork is stupid <laughs> when you're that powerful. And Ultron avoided the Hulk. Yeah. Like, like, like Ultron said, I'm taking over the whole world except for this spot right here. You said you want to be left alone. I'm going to leave you alone. All right. And the Hulk said, okay. Doomsday. He doesn't ever need a, like a, a mini villain with him. Nah. Dark side just comes up and just, he, like, he, he, ha he sends people because it amuses him. <laughs> Otherwise, he just could be down to do, do it himself. Goku doesn't really need other people. Goku's, yeah, yeah. Like, at most, he needs Vegeta for Vegeta. And he doesn't really need... I think I think he needs Vegeta just for comic relief. He's like, look at what your kid do! <laughs> and then so Vegeta starts up. crying in the middle of the fight because, you know, Goku is so much more powerful. I feel bad because... Is. Isn't, isn't Super Saiyan 4 Goku stronger than Vegeta? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Me, by myself, is stronger than both of us put together. <laughs> Well, no, not a, not not Super Saiyan Four Vegeta though. All oh, right, yeah. Wait, go, go, uh, Vegeta or Vegeta got to Super Saiyan Four? Yeah, remember they did the Alpha. Oh, you, oh, you, you didn't watch? No, the, no, no, no. Remember, like the Boma hit him with the thing, and he was yeah, like, yeah, and he yeah, became yeah, Super yeah, Saiyan yeah, Four, okay. and then they merged. Yeah, okay. but because because their power was so high, they burned it out in like ten minutes. Right. Which, Which by the way, the whole fighting Superman thing, um, Superman's power doesn't go away in ten minutes. I'm just it saying, it doesn't. In fact, he could probably just. Leave and like go in space and wait ten minutes. Come back. Yeah, because uh, Goku can't breathe in space. Or you just, or even just with them having the power, just punch him in the face and win. I mean, oh, and if Goku goes to the sun, he is dead. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Sorry, all you uh, Goku lovers. It wouldn't work. It would not. I mean, there's just no, there's no version of the story that turns out. Good. I mean, he, <laughs> like, he, he'd have to wish on the dragon to become Kryptonian. With, Which with the sun can do. You, sure, you don't think the you, dragon can't make wishes for things that are that are more powerful than it is? No, no. Like all, all you do is just become Kryptonian, and then the yellow sun takes care of the rest. He would just have to go hide for about thirty years and, and catch up on the sunlight, <laughs> but then come back. And Superman's like, "Cool, but I've had thirty extra years, so you actually need to go back in time and do this." <laughs> but uh, he could make that wish though. He could make that wish, but that would take two but then Superman would have Dragon to go Ball occurrences. With I'm pretty sure Superman's not gonna sit there and let it happen. Yeah, no. Nah, he, he might would. just kill the dragon and eat it. <laughs> it's like I'm here to oh, that seems more like something the Hulk would do uh, yeah like, ooh dragon <sighs> but anyways we, we digress Nardo stupid <laughs> it, it hasn't been it has not been the, the best manga, manga is awful um, we read it because we we want us to the end and speaking of things okay look I know how how much I love Attack on Titan um, the anime mm-hmm the past few issues of the manga have been so hard to read. Are you caught up, though? I haven't read the last one. Oh, well, you, know, you want me to tell you? Yeah. I think okay, so in the, la in the current chapter of Attack on Titan, they're starting, they're getting ready to start a rebellion because they're like, yeah, the people who are, the king is stupid. 
they're all stupid. The Survey Corps will do it better. We're just going to take over. Good. Yeah, finally. Yeah, it's just, it's just <laughs> this conclusion, like, right? in issue one. Like, as soon as they found Aaron, like, hey, guy, we have an idea. We're going to take over this because this is stupid. This is, we ain't got time. Ain't no one got time for this. <laughs> they should have done that in issue one. Yeah. Would've, that would have made, well, it wouldn't have made for as much an in, uh, interesting right. reading. So, but, yeah, uh, they're going to they're gonna try a rebellion. But it's just, I mean, I'm sure, I know a lot of people like the manga because that came before the anime. But now that I've seen the anime, the manga just not doing it for me. Yeah, and for me, it's just it's a matter of like I, it's a I actually to read it. Yeah, I I like the manga up until like issue forty one ish, something like that, and then it got really really wordy. Yeah, like I didn't want to like I didn't want to see what's her name's backstory. The 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 chick that everyone's in love with. Uh, Ymir? No, no, no. no um, well, the girl Ymir wants to marry. Yeah, her, uh, Krista. Krista. Yeah, I, I, I didn't get it. I mean, I don't know. Maybe like the translation I read was kind of off because it seems like they don't have the best scan leaders for mm-hmm. this manga. Which I don't know. I don't know why you wouldn't have the best scan leaders for this manga. But um, it was just like it's sometimes it's physically hard to read. Like, yeah, the there are. It's kind of. There are moments when you're yeah. reading it and and like what you just read doesn't make any sense. Right. Like period. It is like not like not like you know, I didn't need to know that, but like what the heck was that you just said? Right. Yeah. Uh, so I'm, I'm I'm I know the anime will make it better whenever it comes back. But first of all, I don't know why it's not already out. Because if I was a coney behind that, it 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 already be done. Yeah. Like, I'd like like we got it. We got a new issue out. So put it up. Yeah. yeah. Just I mean like forget catch, seasons. Just as you get them catch done, up, put it up. Catch, catch up to the manga. And then surpass it, and then make a better ending because we already we all read the spoiler ending, so <laughs> which is probably still the ending, even though he said it's not. You don't believe a corporation? <laughs> okay, it's a, it's a Japanese corporation though. They will commit suicide if you like if your enjoyment's not above like level ten. Okay, well then, so Naruto's author is gonna be dead. <laughs> Bleach's author is gonna oh, be dead. Oh god! And, okay, so uh, Bleach. Um, have you read any Bleach? I I started back to reading Bleach a couple of it's days ago. So so awful. It doesn't even feel like Bleach right now. It's just they they just say things that don't make sense, and the enemies are stupid powerful, like not like amazingly powerful, like but like stupid and powerful. And it just, they had a wrestler whose power was he gets cheered on by his fan. Okay, the wrestler part, okay, I can I can tolerate that. But he's the fan that goes, yay! He goes, I'm healed. No, this is Bleach. This is not Toriko or One Piece or some stupid bullcrap. Or maybe bleach. it is. Maybe this oh. is the fight. This is maybe, maybe this is what he's doing. He's like, you know, forget you. I was supposed to go out of business like two months ago. I'm still writing this book. And I'm going to put everything everybody else loves about every other anime or, man- or manga in here until you guys tell me so to stop. Awful. It's awful. Re- it's really it's terrible. Te- okay. I, like, I'm, I'm, I'm reading it now for the Bonkais. It's about it. Why did... Okay. Once... And, and, and uh, yes, we've, we've addressed this before. Once... The Captain Yamato was told, or Yamato, um, yeah, uh, Yamato, yeah, yeah, or Yamamoto, Yamamoto, yeah, Yamamoto, yeah, y- Yamato, y- Yamato is a uh, Naruto, yeah. yeah, okay, yeah. Once Yamamoto was told, when they know what your bankai is, they can take it. Why would he do it? Oh, it, it was once they see all your moves, the bankai, and they hadn't they hadn't seen that one that he's never used. Like, okay, let me immediately use it. Mm, mm, I wanted to punch a baby in the face when I read that. <laughs> I was like, "Why? Why?" We should you do an entire video on things on that don't make the, sense in in, 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 in in Bleach or in manga, in, in manga and in comic books. You know, things we like ain't got time for the comic one. That's like just, things like, like Spider Man suddenly being Doc Ock. Okay, so well, okay, well, um, so that's, that's that's what we feel about Naruto. <laughs> Um, some cool things have been happening. Uh, some rumors. Uh, the team uh, Legacy Effects, the people behind Iron Man Three and uh, Pacific Rim, who are teaming up with Tomino for an unnamed live action movie, have been seen with a Japanese team in the Philippines. And the reporting was that it may be the live action Gundam movie. Hopefully, it won't be like G Savior, and it will be better. So, 
there's that. I started following Gal Gadot on uh, Twitter. Oh, we should probably follow her on ours then. Yeah, because yeah. like she she's posting pictures of herself working out, trying to get in shape for Wonder Woman. Mm. And uh, I mean, I'm not going to say that she looks like Wonder Woman yet, but she looks better. Like she's gotten more muscular. She's and she's got a shape now. Well, she's probably got like people on Twitter telling her every day, "You're not good enough." <laughs> <laughs> like, like in 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 the fast in in the Fast and Furious movies, she's kind of well straight. Like when you look at the picture of her on Twitter, she actually has a shape. It's like there's a form there. She looks like a woman, and I was like, oh my god, give me about twenty five more pounds of that, and you might actually be okay. All up here, <laughs> <laughs> they're gonna have to augment that some other way. I'm just saying. That's uh, hey, they're 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 rich in Hollywood. They can figure it out. Hey, you know who would have made a good Wonder Woman? Hmm. That chick who's playing Sarah on a on um, Arrow, think, if she was taller, because she she, yeah. she seems she seems to be kind of short. Yeah, but up here but, it's all good though. Yeah, so, yeah, all that 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 that, that works. works. That, I mean, that is, I mean, like I I, I know uh, Huntress was a little jealous, but it's like, dude, look at her, look at you. She wasn't a little jealous. She was very jealous. Yeah. Like she walked in and said, "Wow, you look way better than I do." <laughs> I, I, I don't know maybe it's just like the, the whatever she's wearing that makes it look like that but it's like it works yeah like it, there's no like Oliver may love Laurel more but he saw her in leather he was like dang <laughs> how could you love Laurel more I mean seriously she's whiny she's stupid she is cute now that she's gained she, the weight now back. Now she's cute. She was yeah. alien five weeks ago. <laughs> she gained the weight back. Oh, but yeah, like if you if, if you were watching and paying attention to what we were paying attention to when Laurel was looking all like gaunt and not good at all, she gained the weight back. She looks healthy again. She's, you know, she's pretty again. <sighs> that, that made me feel better about life. It really did. And for, for a while, I was worried about her. I, I actually went back and watched a video where we were talking about that. Mm. And I was just like, wow, yeah, no, she yeah, she was looking terrible. Yeah. She looks much better now. So. Good job. There's that. Uh, the Flash's costume is eh. Yeah. Uh, I didn't like it. Um, if you know what Oculus Rift is, um, it got bought by Facebook this week. And uh, everyone was pissed off who, you know, supported the Kickstarter for it. And uh, Notch, the guy who does Minecraft, has said, yeah, my game's not coming to Oculus. It was sad. <laughs> but I'm glad he's uh, supporting. Because he's like, I put 10 grand into that thing. <laughs> and now <laughs> Facebook is going to come in and buy it. And you know, when they release it, it's going to be all about Facebook. Mm-hmm. It's going to have like a, like a giant F on the, on the front. And it's be like, hey, now you can watch Facebook in virtual reality. Hey, how about video games? No, just Facebook. Uh, give us five hundred dollars, and you know people are gonna do it. Yeah, people will do it. Yeah. Oh, um, Peter Parker comes back this week. Yeah, but that that's happening. So yeah, for me, Second Son, by the way, like we said, we're gonna talk about is a good game. Get it and enjoy it. It's better than Titanfall. It Yay. just is. Yeah, it's really fun. It's it feels next gen. The story is actually pretty good. The fighting is pretty good. I miss Cole because he was a good character, but uh, Delson's a pretty good character too. Just you know, the first two games were about Cole, but you know, hey, that's cool. We can just switch to another character. Well, I mean, why not? I mean, let, let's see. Um, Bionic Commando did it. Yeah, but like Cole was the reason for people ha- having powers in Infamous, though. Devil May Cry. No, it didn't happen. Actually, it stopped right before that game happened. I don't know what that game was. That that, that <laughs> last one, where he had like the British flag and stupid lesbian haircut. But I don't. You don't acknowledge that movie, that game? No, I don't actually. It's the only one I never played or bought. It's actually, so awful. Come to think of it, no, no, I did play it for about ten seconds. Why? Because I didn't realize that it wasn't the same guy until the game started, and it wasn't the same guy. You're like, yeah, oh, 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 no, no, no. <laughs> it was wrong. It was just wrong. Um, oh, so, t- happier things. WonderCon, a couple weeks, the 18th to the 20th. Yay! We'll be at Small Press Booth 83. Come see us. Yay! We're not, not, we're not in RSL anymore. We're moving on up. We moved up. 
to bigger and better things. <laughs> so yeah, come see us. We'll have Heroes of Us 1, 2, and 3. Um, the project will be reprinted and we'll have uh, a couple new books with, with us. And if uh, somebody, <clears throat> Walter, um, gets the novels printed, we'll have novels too. Yeah, there, there's one more uh, that I, I, I need to edit. But you haven't found a printer yet. I'm working on it. Okay, all right. I've got, I've got quotes. All right, whatever quotes. Also, um, we have two cons. <laughs> we have two con, two cons in May. We have um, a con on Free Comic Book Day. It's uh, I think that the name right now is Tustin Library Mini Con. Um, we're 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 trying to get that turned. No, into they. I think they. I think they already printed it. Like, we we had to like midnight the other day, and like he already. Yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll just we'll, we'll hijack them <laughs> we'll just like mark it out but the, 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 the tagline is think different and that came from us so yay anyways uh, the Tustin Library and a bunch of other groups are coming together um, to hold a little convention on free comic book day and uh, we're going to be part of that and uh, there'll, be, there'll be some press out there so you know you might hear about us on the news because you know that's what, that's what we do now that's the level we're at but, uh, <laughs> um, but yeah, so, and then, uh, at the end of the month, there's Long Beach Comic Con, which is May 31st and June, to June 1st, mm. um, we'll be at that con. We won't have a table there, because we were invited as part of the show, so we'll have an event both days at the, in the kids' area for Heels Are Us. That's right. And we'll have, we'll debut two, God willing, two games <laughs> for Heels Are Us. One's a, one's just a card game, the other one's gonna be like, like a board game. God willing, so we're doing big things. We told them to put it in the in the program, so I'm really hoping we come with it. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, so I mean, these next couple months we have a lot of things happening. If you don't see videos coming out as regular, that is why. So yeah, we're busy. Yeah, we're really busy. <sighs> but yeah, so, so that's. Uh, I think we've caught everybody up. Yeah, you all caught up, and uh, hopefully at the end of this month or end of April. We'll be, we have a new artist who's coming on who'll be doing a really, really awesome series that we're really excited about that I won't tell you about because I won't leave you hanging on that. But it's going to be really cool. <laughs> so, uh, but that's that's it for this week. Uh, until next time, we've been your host, Kirby King. And Black Superman. See you later, guys. Hey, guys, don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe, and share our videos like crazy. That's right, because we love you, we want you to love us, and we want to keep making videos for you. And keep leaving us comments. We love comments. Yes, and we answer comments. Unlike some of the other guys, we'll get out there, we'll answer, and if you uh, have a great comment, we'll make a video about it. And if you have a not so great comment, we will try to address that issue. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, thanks. Till next time, we'll be your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. See you later, guys.